What's going on Clash Bashers? Rocky here today and today we're going to be starting a brand new Town Hall 12. That's right guys, we took Meg up from Town Hall 11 all the way up to Town Hall 12. We're going to be checking out what to do first at Town Hall 12 and literally the upgrade just finished uh, and we're going to we're going to see what the villager has to say. Your town hall now fires back at the attackers. So if you don't know, the town hall gets the Giga Tesla at Town Hall 12. It's a huge thing. You can upgrade it. You can get that Giga Bomb, which is really, really awesome. We'll kind of talk about that as we're going through here. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to set up a progress base so we can talk about all the priority of all the upgrades and then kind of go from there. So that's the battle plan for today, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to leave a like on the video. And also, uh, don't forget to use code BASH. It'll be up there in a second. <laughs> don't forget to use code BASH. So let me go ahead and set up that progress base. We did max out Town Hall 11 100 100% so we are ready to hop into Town Hall 12. Alrighty guys, so let's hop into it. Let's talk about a brand new Town Hall 12. Now I'm sure some of you guys are thinking, Bash, Town Hall 9 won the pool. Guys, I've done like literally seven Town Hall 9 Let's Plays and nothing has really changed at Town Hall 9 in like a couple years to be honest. Uh, I'm gonna do a Town Hall 9, but I'm trying to figure out like how to put a twist on it so it's just not like a regular Town Hall 9 Let's Play. However, I haven't played Town Hall 12 in a while and Town Hall 12 seems like it could be fun with the Yetis and stuff. So I want to play with the Town Hall 12 to start us. Now, also, there is one huge announcement in this video. Uh, we're going to be opening up Irritated Ram again. There will be details on that a little bit later in the video. Uh, you're not going to be able to just join and get in. You're going to need a password, and I'll give those details a little bit later in the video. But let's talk about it. Let's talk about what to do first at Town Hall 12. Now, I went ahead and made a progress base, and I will link that in the description because I know you guys always like the progress bases. Uh, so there are a few buildings that don't need any upgrades at Town Hall 12. We have all the collectors, the elixir collectors, the gold mines, and the dark elixir drills. All of our resources... Those are already maxed. We don't need to upgrade those any levels. We also have our Spell Factory and our Dark Spell Factory. You can see I'm wasting a little bit of a boost while I was farming, but that's okay. Those are both upgraded. And then also our Dark Barracks is upgraded and does not need to be maxed. So a good chunk that doesn't need to be maxed. And then also our Traps. Giant Bombs aren't maxed, but they don't need to go up till 13. Same with Seeking Air Mines. Our spring traps are going to be maxed, our skeleton traps are going to be maxed, and then our air bomb, our regular bombs rather, not going to need to go up till Town Hall 13, and then finally our sweepers are going to be maxed out. Now we are going to get a few new buildings, let's go ahead and talk about that before we get into all of this. Uh, so if we go in here, there's always that Town Hall 12 pack, honestly I'm not really going to worry about buying that. I did a little bit of farming, so we had a little bit of loot, uh, but really we want to kind of get a feel for it. We're going to get the workshop, and the workshop priority is going to be dependent on... Uh, like what kind of clan you're in if you're in a clan that doesn't have any sieges or uh, You're the first one in your clan with sieges or you might want to get your workshop early I'm not gonna sweat it right away. Uh, we'll get it really early, but I'm not sweating it right away However, we have stuff like this hidden Tesla. We have all these new traps We're gonna want to buy these right away and even that inferno tower when you're at town hall 12 uh, you're going to weigh pretty heavy anyways, especially as you're upgrading that town hall and we'll talk about the town hall upgrades it's not going to, war weight's not going to really matter. You're going to want to get your stuff upgraded, your offense, but at the same time, you want to have a strong defense. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to throw down that hidden Tesla, which I saved a little spot for right there. Three hour upgrade hidden Tesla be done. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to buy all of these traps. Now traps are pretty cheap. These ones especially are pretty cheap and easy since they'll be, you know, level ones. Uh, we'll be able to buy build those relatively quickly. Uh, air bomb, and then giant bomb. We'll throw. We'll just throw that right there. These are things you're going to be able to throw down, uh, like when you have a builder free and not quite enough loot for a big upgrade. You can throw down these little traps. Uh, so we definitely want to get that inferno tower. Uh, we just don't quite have enough uh, gold right now, which we'll get there. Now. I always have, like, I always set stuff up in the priority I want to upgrade it. And that's exactly what we've done here. Now, the town hall, we're going to kind of work on at our own pace. But honestly, I want to get this bad boy up to level 5. Because when you get it up to level 5, you get that Giga Bomb unlocked. You get the Giga Tesla right away. But you get that Giga Bomb when you get to level 5. Which is going to be 1,000 damage. Which is massive. People have to plan around it. Uh, you also get more targets as you upgrade it. You want to get that town hall going up relatively quick. Whenever you get to a brand new town hall, no matter what, always, 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 you want to get the laboratory up first. That's just, 
That's the plain and simple facts of it, guys. You want to get the laboratory going up. That way you can get troops upgrading and going. And then the clan castle is pretty much the same. You're going to want to get that clan castle up so you can hold more troops or spells or whatever it may be for that town hall level. For here, we're going to get five more troops. It's also going to add a little bit more hit points. And then heroes are always going to be a huge priority. Uh, we're going to prioritize queen, warden, and then king. Uh, as far as our order, remember, we have quite a few levels to go. We go, what, to 65, 65, 30? Is that right? We have quite a bit of levels to go. And then you want to get your army camps up. Like, the heroes, you're obviously not going to do all at once. But you're going to want to kind of work on them. But army camps are going to be a huge priority. This is immediately going to add five capacity to your army per army camp. So you're going to add 20 space to your army. These are huge upgrades. You definitely want to knock them out. You definitely want to get them done right away. And then I have the barracks kind of high because I want to unlock Yetis. I personally want to play with some Yeti Smash at Town Hall 12. I want to see how it's going to work. Uh, it's not an, uh, an attack I've got to use because I haven't been at Town Hall 12 since the Yetis have came out. So I want to play with that. So we're going to unlock Yetis really early on. And then you want to get your storages up because we have like runes and stuff. So you want to try to get the most out of those. And then as far as defenses go... Traps are going to be really easy to upgrade, really uh, simple upgrades to do. You're going to want to prioritize those high. But seriously, the Tornado Trap needs to be a top priority uh, just because it adds a full second duration on there and it helps out. Eagle is a monster of a defense. It does a ton of damage. It can really slow down an attack. Uh, people plan around Eagles just as much as Town Halls. Uh, then we're going to we're going to be buying that third inferno here shortly. Uh, we'll talk about that. We'll get that here in a few uh, and then if we're going to get infernos and then bows and then we'll kind of work on our wizard towers. I prioritize Tesla's and air defenses about the same. Uh, I really like Tesla's my favorite defense in the game and then air defenses are going to slow down air attacks and then archer towers cannons bomb towers and mortars and then walls kind of as you're going because you're going to have to upgrade all of the walls. It's it's not pretty, guys. But let's go ahead. Let's start off by upgrading our laboratory here. Uh, I thought I had a book of building. I guess I don't have a book of building. Uh, oh, you know what? I had to use it on the town hall. Whoops! I should have used. I should have used a hammer of upgrade. Eh, that's all right. Uh, for the video, you know, whatever. We'll jump this. We do have some gems on this count. I don't want to go like crazy jumping it. Uh, but. The laboratory is going to be really interesting. It's going to be really dependent on what you're good at, what you like to use, and what you farm with. Now, me personally, just knowing what I like to use, what uh, my own personal bias on stuff, uh, at Town Hall at Town Hall 12, you're going to have a lot of options, but the 5 Ice Golem with Bats is still going to be viable at Town Hall 12. Uh, you're going to have Pekka Smash really viable. You're going to have... There's a lot of good stuff viable at Town Hall 12. We'll do like a full lab guide kind of soon. Uh, but we'll come back to that here momentarily. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to use this hammer to upgrade the clan castle. It's a 14-day upgrade, so we get the full upgrade. We immediately get those five troops, uh, and we can knock that out with gold. That way our gold can go into other stuff, such as the Town Hall and whatnot. Uh, so we'll go ahead and knock that out. Uh, and then, let's see... We do need to spend a little bit of this gold, though. Uh, so let's go ahead. Let's upgrade a spring trap. Upgrade a spring trap here. I'm just trying to get through some of this gold. Okay, so that's... Actually, uh, we could have done that. Eh, it's all right. It's all right, guys. We'll be fine. So we'll probably end up wasting just a little bit of gold. Do I have any in here? I do not have any gold. It's bad. It's bad, man. All right, so... Uh, that's that. Uh, we, we, oh, wait, wait. I know where I have a little bit of gold hiding. In here. There we go. We'll grab that. Uh, we'll get that, uh, what was it? The giant bomb? No. The air bomb up. Uh, that way we can use as much gold as possible. Because, yes, I do want to get as much value out of my runes as possible. But I also want to get stuff going up. So, I'm, I, you know... I don't know. I'm on the fence about like what I want to do with that. As far as upgrades go in the laboratory, since we don't have a ton of elixir, I mean, we could pop this elixir rune, but really, I I don't know. I think I think it's probably better just to kind of hold on to it, but we do want to get something going up in the lab right away, and I think for me personally, it's going to be bowlers. Uh, actually, we can use the hammer of fighting on bowlers. Bowlers are going to be good for like Pekka Bow Bat, Pekka Smash, the Yeti Smash, uh, the five Ice Golem Bats. Uh, like, bowlers are going to be used 
quite a bit around. So let's actually use our hammer on the bowlers uh, because they're just such a versatile troop. And then I also, I'm going to go ahead and throw down, for me personally, I'm going to throw down the bat spell. Actually, we're going to upgrade the bat spell with the hammer. Uh, we'll throw down the witches next, actually. There we go. That'll be a nice upgrade. Uh, I'm not going to go ahead and book that because uh, we need a little bit more time. Now, I want to get the P.E.K.K.A.s going, uh, but we also need a little bit more loot. And I want to get these uh, storages going. So, the storage is going to be really high priorities. Now, what we're going to need to do is we're going to be farming like crazy. We do have a builder available. And what we're going to do is we're going to start working on getting these storages filled, getting that dark elixir storage upgraded. Really, these are pretty cheap. We could probably knock these out first and we'll get the town hall going. Like I said, uh, once we get the storages up, we're gonna wanna focus on the town hall, focus on those army camps, get all that kind of stuff going. I think the storages are actually higher priority. I'm kind of jumping all over the place, I know. Uh, so let's go ahead and do a little bit of farming. Like I said, this is kind of like my general plan for the account I mean you know it's always like kind of play by ear when you get runes and we tend to get a lot of runes those storages are really important uh, I do want to get the yetis up but those storages make a huge difference so we have the basalt assault event going on uh, using some lava hounds and that's what I've been doing is I've just been doing some loonian farming uh, I know that just said ice golems but I'm gonna put some balloons uh, some lava loonian farming in here and it's been pretty decent uh, working out so let me see. I'm going to go out. I'm going to find us a base. We're going to smack it. Let me throw in some balloons. And we'll kind of go from there, guys. We'll chill out. We'll start farming. And then we'll come back. And I'll have those details on how to join the clan right when we come back. All right, guys. So I don't know how I'm going to do against this one, to be honest with you. It's going to be a tough base. Uh, but it's got a lot of loot. So we're going to try it. Now, as far as, like, you want to rem remember, we do have that Inferno available. I know I'm all over the place. But... Like, you want to farm really hard when you first get up, because those traps that we built, those are going to be done quick. Uh, we're going to want to get that Inferno building, etc., etc. We're going to try to get the Queen out here. Really, I'm just trying to finish off this event here, try to get a little bit of loot, uh, and keep you guys uh, in the loop. So, we are going to be starting up Irritated Ram. Uh, we're going to be looking for Town Hall 9s through Town Hall 12s, and this, hopefully, is going to be to, like, get a start on getting people, like, interested in in the mad ram clan family we'll see how things go a little bit nervous about it to be honest with you but uh there's only one to, way to find out nice okay so that worked out uh let's go ahead and get that that get these all working in here uh so let's get that there let's go ahead and freeze there all right perfect awesome let's go ahead and hit a rage here let's hit a haste here get some minions in behind to clean all righty Weeper looks like our or single inferno, inferno rather. I got this under control, guys. Uh, look like it's going down. Hit the warden over the town hall. Look at that. We had a plan for that town hall. Literally our whole attack uh, because that town hall is just so nasty. Uh, so let's go ahead and get that moving through there. Now uh, we do have some balloons over here. We have some balloons popping out of the slammer. We definitely want to try to get as much loot as possible. We get a little bit of split on the balloons. Let's go ahead and haste there. We can get to this last sweeper, or this last air defense, rather. Oh, look at that. We're going to three-star as a brand new 12. We're going to three-star a 12. That's what I like to see, guys. I, I did not actually expect to three-star that one. I was, ugh. I, I, didn't, I didn't think that would happen. But we're going to get a good amount of loot here. We're going to work on that event. Like I said, I'm all over the place during these videos. Uh, but you want to just farm like crazy. Uh, get those initial buildings down. Go ahead and build that inferno. It's not going to hurt you. It's not going to be the end of the world. Keep your lab going. That's going to be one of the biggest things. Keep the lab going. But really, I want to get those storages upgrading as soon as possible, guys. Look at that rain. One million, one million, basically. Um, so what I'm going to be doing is, like, as I'm getting stuff free, I'm going to be dropping down these storages, all of them right here. I'm going to save those runes until our storages are upgraded. They're not too long of upgrades. Six-day upgrades. I might even have some builder potions to speed it up. Yeah, we got five builder potions. Um, and then we'll talk about, you know, more lab stuff and all that kind of stuff in the next video. Now, let's talk about the clan. Irritated Ram. This is... Uh, this is a clan that we tried to run a while ago as a Town Hall 9 and 10 clan. But like I said, we're going to go Town Hall 9 through 12. First of all, you can't be rushed. 
Uh, if you're going to be a 9, I'm going to want to see like 15-15 heroes uh, and not going up to Town Hall 10 because you maxed out all your bases because you didn't uh, farm your heroes right away. Uh, really, we're going to be looking, I think the main focus is going to be like 10s and 11s. Again, not rushed. I'm going to want to see from Town Hall 10s, 40-40 Town Hall 10 heroes. Uh, or no, 30-30 to 40-40. 30-30 minimum for Town Hall 10s. Like, really, I want to see, uh, you know, well-developed stuff. For Town Hall 11s, I want to see that 40-40 minimum heroes on the King and Queen. Get that Warden going. And a few Town Hall 12s. We're not going to take a ton of Town Hall 12s. A few Town Hall 12s. Now, don't don't worry about the Discord. We're not... They, they messed up the description. Uh, I have a leadership team in place. They are going to be in charge. Uh, and we're going to be looking to war. The clan is only level 5. So if you're coming over here, I'm expecting you to war. Don't have a war timer. Now, how do you get in? Well, this video, for reference, is going to release at 11 a.m. Eastern Time. So when you started this video or when you got the notification for it, it was 11 a.m. Eastern Time. At 6 p.m. Eastern Time, that's 7 hours from now, I'm going to set the clan to invite. Now you're going to need a password. What is the password going to be? That's, well, that's, that's a great, pa that's a great question. What are we going to make the password? Let's go ahead and let's make the password monster. That's right. M O N S T E R. You need the password when you apply. So when you apply to the clan, put the word monster in there. Don't be rushed. Uh, just come in. We got, a, we got a good amount of spots. We got like, we'll have 34 spots available uh, because CB will be gone. He's just on for this video. Uh, we do have, you know, 13 in here to help out with some siege barracks. We got a good array. I got my accounts in here so you guys can hang out with me. We got leadership in place. So again, 6 p.m. Eastern time, monster. Now, if you're in a clan and you're in war, don't leave your clan. I might kick you if you leave your clan and you have a war timer that's longer than a day. That's rude. Don't do that to your clan. They don't deserve it. Like, it's rude. People will leave the clan. We'll have openings. I'm not going to open the clan every single time one person leaves. Uh, and usually I'll announce when we're opening it at least five to ten openings uh, in between openings. But we'll see how that goes. But let's go ahead. Let's work on finishing up this event. We only need uh, one more attack. So let's see. Uh, I'm not even going to worry about heroes. Let's just see if we can find something and try to get a two-star. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be farming like crazy. I'm going to try to get those storages down, get those going. Uh, really, I'm going to focus on, like, all four at one time. So, like, I want to get all four of, like, the elixir storages, for instance, down at one time. Uh, that way I can, you know, be able to use that kind of rune and then work on it. Uh, especially elixir, we want to be ready for the lab laboratory, excuse me, uh, so that we can get that. Uh, now, this one doesn't have a lot of loot, but it's a Town Hall 11, and I feel like I can get a star on it. Do I go for it? Mm, yeah, let's go for it. Uh, we're, I just want to finish off this event, and then we can kind of go from there. Actually, this army's actually been working pretty decently, though. Let's go and rage here. Oh, of course we get a dragon in here. Why wouldn't we get a dragon? Why wouldn't I get a dragon in my life? I'm just trying to finish off the event nice and easy, nice and cheap, and there's a dragon in the clan castle. Rip the dream, boys. Rip the dream. All right, let's go ahead and just haste all that through. Uh, let's see if all of our troops can get the dragon out. Nice. Dragon goes down. All right. So we'll get the event finished off. I'm not super worried about loot there. But that's uh, that's a decent idea of how to start Town Hall 12. Uh, it gives you guys a general basis of how to upgrade and all that kind of stuff. Like I said, do get that Inferno down. I'm going to worry about getting my storages down first. I guess the storages are really a higher priority, but... That's okay. We want to get those army camps up. Like, all that stuff in the beginning, you can't go by, wrong by upgrading it. You need to get that stuff up as soon as possible. It's only going to hurt you. It's not going to help or hinder you at all. I, I know how to talk. We got this under control. So work on all that stuff. Get it all upgraded. Get your defenses going. You got a ton of walls. Don't neglect your walls like I always do. And then you have a bunch of walls to upgrade at the end of your town hall. Uh, let's just go ahead and end there. That way we can finish off the uh, event right here. There we go. Event completed. Nice, guys. Nice. Awesome. So we got the uh, resource potions. We can boost that and kind of move on with our life. So let's actually... I'm just going to run some more Lunian. Why not? It's been fun. It's been fun. So there we go, guys. That's how you start Town Hall 12. If you guys want to join our clan, I uh, hope to see you all there. Please also don't get butt hurt if you don't get in the clan. There's only going to be 34 spots. This video is going to get thousands of views. 
not everyone's going to be able to make it, but this is one way we can get some people in to the clan. Again, password monster. Good luck to you guys. I'll see you all there. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to leave a like on the video. Give me ideas of how I can make the Town Hall 9 interesting. I don't know. Like, ugh, Town Hall 9 is just the same. How can I make it interesting? Hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys have a great day. Keep on Clash Bashing. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to subscribe and turn on those notifications. That way you don't miss any future uploads of mine. And if you did happen to miss yesterday's video, you can check it out right over there.